At this makeshift camp, everything's a struggle. Families forced to flee a wave of Taliban attacks in Helmand province, now squatting in a half-built vegetable market. Her mother explains how their home became a front line as Taliban forces attacked government troops three weeks ago. In the provincial capital Lashkagar, the governor even says militants linked to the terrorist group Al Qaeda took part in the assault, a claim the Taliban strongly denies. British forces spent eight years in Helmand fighting the Taliban, but their core goal was to stop Al Qaeda from ever again having a safe haven in the country. The Taliban pledged to cut ties with the group as part of a peace deal with the United States, signed in February in Qatar. <laughs> Evidence that's not happening would be a serious blow. In Helmand, the recent clashes forced up to 35,000 people to flee their homes. Some weren't fast enough. Casualties surged at the main trauma hospital. <laughs> These families aren't the only ones suffering, as there's violence across the country. The government has started historic peace talks with the Taliban, but life for now remains hostile. Deborah Haynes, Sky News.